this officer who's had many different cases, not many, he has two separate cases where he abused his authority on black people as well. And now we have this case where he walks into a classroom and and he um, basically treats this young black little girl like she's um, like she just robbed a bank or she just killed someone. Yeah, Kevin Smith is a level 12 pedophile. I, I definitely agree, Thomas. I definitely agree. Um, I guess he thought I wouldn't speak his mind because I guess he thought I wouldn't speak my mind. I mean, if he calls in, I wasn't going to clown him to, from the giddy up. You know, I, I messaged him in the comment section. And I said, well, Kev, call him to the show. He immediately responds with, um, fuck your show. I'm not calling your show. Your show's stupid. Blase, blase, blah. I never disrespected this clown or nothing. But I don't have a problem saying fuck him. I have no problem saying fuck him at, at the end of the day. And, and, and like I said, bitch-ass Kevin Smith, man, he, he made two videos talking, calling the little girl a bitch and all this other shit. That little yeah. fat, dumpling-eating, faggot needs yeah. his ass whooped. Go suck a, ice, a, a dick sickle, nigga. I invited you on the line. Your bitch ass said, fuck man. the show. Go suck a dick sickle, Stupid. pussy. <laughs> Matter of fact, go, go make another roast video about Monty. Monty, Monty, Monty got AIDS. Monty got AIDS. Go talk about Monty for another six years, you fucking faggot. Yeah, what's up? Can you hear me? Yeah, we hear you. Yeah, I, uh, I, I, I don't condone it, but if that Uh-oh. child had just got up, uh oh! You know, get the corner. Get the corner. Get your 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 Get your corner. 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 He's a good white man. He's a good whitey. And hey, it's her fault at the end of the day. So they what completely about, hey, ignore him not what about to the his Listen, let me, let me say this. Let me say this. Let me say this before y'all be stupid. Because y'all ignorant anyway. Let me say this. <laughs> you, got, you got a whole school. No, what we, we, we got is an Uncle Ruckus on the fucking line. Talk about somebody, nigga. You sound Mike, stupid. You won't even the, hold up, hold up, Chrissy. The tone to say, of your you voice, the, the literal, to, the literal tone of your voice sounds stupid, sir. Like, like your <laughs> voice tone sounds stupid. Everything about you sounds stupid, and you sound like that cartoon character Uncle Ruckus. If she would have only listened, <laughs> get the fuck out of here. <laughs> this nigga sound like Fred G. Sanford. Uh, it's the big one. This is the big one. Get the fuck off the line, Fred G. Sanford. Stupid motherfucker. <laughs> and these motherfuckers completely ignore that this cop Conan, 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 Conan. I don't, I don't get this shit, man. Right. You calling people Conan, but you won't even let them talk and make their point, and they and you kicking people no, off. Oh, no, nah, Chrissy, people disrespect, disrespect my show. They're they getting cut off. He just, he just called me out of my name. What did he say bye-bye. to you? What, well, what if you didn't he hear say? it, you didn't hear it. You, you don't, you, I, I, heard I couldn't it. hear it because you were talking over him. All right, I understand. But go ahead, people. Y'all go ahead and push the one if y'all got something to say. If you if you're not disres- if you're disrespectful, you getting caught the line, point blank. Period. I mean, it's my first time. I that. don't condone it, but I don't condone it, but I mean, it, as soon as you hear that, but you know what's coming next. I don't condone I hear, I hear, it, but sometimes the master want to whip your ass. Okay, but but what do you want to happen to the little girl? Mike what do you e. Dookie. mean? What I want to happen to her? What happened to her already happened to her. I'm talking about what Mikey happened to the Dookie. officer. <laughs> Who's that? that? That's Chris. I don't know I don't who that is. That's, That's one of your fans. Her. That's one of your fans. They care more about you than you care about yourself. I guess so. God damn. But I you keep saying to that I have a problem with this girl, even when I start talking about Mikey the Dookie. officer. <laughs> You 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 know what, Kevin? You you could get your faggot ass on the line, man. I know you're upset. You're at the house sucking frozen dick sickles and dreaming about Monty. But if you want to call in and dead this beef right now, we'll see you can say whatever you want to say right now, nigga. You you don't gotta be t- texting me on on YouTube talking shit. I, I mean, truly, I wasn't gonna let, I wasn't gonna let your faggot ass on the line. But you can get and call in because I already know you're gonna you're gonna be doing thirty fucking videos <laughs> in the next thirty days. Talking about dumb shit because you, you can't have no real fucking discussions because you're a fucking idiot. Talking about you're a level twelve genius, but who, who and, and and you had a black tax. Yo, Kevin, this is this is for some real shit. This guy said he had he wanted to do a black tax 
where he wanted black people to donate to him, and he's going to help the black community. Who in their right fucking mind would donate money to Kevin Clitoris Smith, a known fag, and, and expect him to help the, the black community? This, this is a man who got on camera and sucked a frozen icicle shaped like a dick, talking about this how he like his dick sucked. Yes. This nigga got on camera. You know, these guys have, have done some of the weirdest shit I've ever seen done on YouTube. And they ask me why I don't show my face all the time, because I don't really want to be connected to your niggas like that. That's, that's why I stopped showing my face. Because you niggas is lames, man. You niggas is lame. Kevin Smith sucking a yeah, frozen a frozen um, treat shaped like a dick, talking about this is how he like his dicks up. And who who are you clowning when you did that? He thinks he, thinks he was clowning Monty when he did that shit. Hey, hey, Kevin, Kevin Smith, lightweight, wants Monty in his exit hole. Yo, I, yo, real talk, I think Kevin Smith wants to have sex with Monty. Because you know what? I mean, I don't like Monty too much like that either, but you don't see me doing 50 fucking videos about the dude, can't stop talking about him. I mean, I understand the roast game, but, nigga, you've been doing this shit for a couple of years now. Monty, Monty, Monty. Nigga, <laughs> nigga, yeah, that, yeah. calm that shit down, man. Yeah, 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 Black Dawn Romeo. He he had a black tax. Yeah, it, no, it, it, it's a good idea, Black Dawn, to to do the black tax and we donate to, to situations for each other. But we're not gonna let this nutcase handle that situation. I wouldn't trust him with no shit like that. So he can go buy uh, male prostitutes and and take and take flights to go suck LA's dick. Nah, I'm not gonna do that. He's he gonna be on pl- flight old. after flight, flying to Michigan, sucking LA's dick. I'm not gonna do it, man. He's always making videos on his stomach with his legs kicked up in the air. Like, Kevin yeah. is a bitch. With his shirt off, his titties out. He always got his little towel on, too. He got two big-ass titties and got the nerve to do videos with his shirt off, with his fat, robust face. <laughs> he fucking crazy, man. <laughs> his, his big old fat, meaty face. And you got the whole big-ass thing. The nigga look like Tina Throw-Up. Kevin Smith looks like <laughs> Tina Throw-Up. Real talk, man. <laughs> She sucks dick for a living. He sucks dicks for free. What the fuck is the difference, man? <laughs> you know, what the fuck? At least she charges for that shit. Yeah, that nigga's retarded. He is titties out all the time, man. Ass up, tits out. <laughs> Kevin's a fag. And got the nerve to defend this fucking terrorist. Man, Kevin's a bitch. Coward. Yeah, because I think when Kevin Smith saw the video, he wanted to suck that cop's dick. That's what it was. <laughs> he, he was he was sexually attracted to the officer. When he seen that video of him lifting weights, that nigga's dick got hard. You see how he follows L.A. After he saw L.A. son was gay and he saw that Chuck E. Cheese video, he was turned on by, by L.A. son. He really was. Yeah, yeah, Kevin Smith, yeah, game time, you right. Kevin wanted to take L.A. son to Chuck E. Cheese. He said, I paid for it. And what did he say about the girl? <laughs> and this is, this is about the, the situation. He said that the girl that the cop slammed down that she even though she's a child, she's damn near an adult. Soon she can she can go she can go to war, she can she can join the military. So basically when he sees a fourteen, fifteen year old little girl, he sees a full fledged adult. And that's why he was this nigga was mailing um boots to a sixteen year old and, and, and was proud about that shit. Damn. He mailed boots to a 16-year-old troll he met on YouTube. This bitch ain't never meet him, ain't never going to meet him. All she seen was a thirsty-ass, old, flabby, fat face, nasty-ass, pedophile faggot that was thirsty. <laughs> she took the fucking boots and said, yeah, I'll keep trolling for you. He thought that was his girlfriend when she was 16 years old. These niggas is pathetic, man. Real talk, man. I mean, all he going to do is do 37 videos saying faggot shit, gay shit. Yeah, yeah, I'll I suck your dick, Mike Mills. i suck your dick. <laughs> That's going to be his roast video. That's going to be his roast video. But pull your dick out, Mike Mills. Let me see your dick. Monty? Monty? <laughs> this nigga's a fag, man. <laughs> oh, shit. I, 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 think, I think Al Dots on the line. I think he wants to defend his man. What up? <laughs> No, I'm here, to, I'm here to just send my son, you shitty monkey. Why the fuck you bring my name in this shit? Uh, listen, I'm not talking about you. I'm talking about no, Kevin Smith. I'm talking about my motherfucking son, though. I'm talking about the fact about that he's attracted to your son. Ain't nobody saying shit about the little hook because it's your faggot ass ass, nigga. <laughs> uh, okay, are you done, Dusty? 
Dusty no, Rhodes, are you done? done? Motherfucker, are you done, Dusty? Shit. Man, you are you done, Dusty? Dusty? Uh, I'm listening to Dusty Rhodes. You listen to Dusty Rhodes. You see how this faggot ass, ass, ass nigga jump, jump back on the line? Look you talking about my man. You talking about my man. How the fuck is you defending the nigga that sucked frozen dick sickles? That's your friend? That's your friend? But then again, L.A., you're the same dude who you said you want people to play with your ass. That's all this booty, all this guy. What the fuck are you talking about? That's what you were at with. Nigga, you do the same shit. You do the same shit, though. What are you talking about? You you say it repeatedly. Play on my asshole. Play on my asshole. Eat my whole ass. That's what you're saying, ass with your mouth, boy. Eat my ass with your mouth, faggot ass nigga. You's a fag. You a fag. Your son's a fag. Kevin Smith's a fag. Now, now, all you get together, be gay together, man. Have a party. Have a gay party, man. It's a gay sex party, man. Go ahead. Do your thing, man. Do your thing. Have a gay sex party. You, Kevin Smith, suck his dick. His son can suck your dick. I mean, fuck it. Do your thing, homo. <laughs> I don't give a fuck, nigga. <laughs> Real yeah, talk, man. Good. Let me take these private phone calls, man. Fucking faggot ass niggas. Um, let me bring on 956. 956. Hello. Hello. What's up? Yeah. I'd like to say the ultimate coning is judging somebody by the sound of their voice. And that's all I got to say. Oh, this is Fred G. Sanford. You know, that that's your new name for now on, man. You you Fred G. Sanford, man. He's the type of you motherfucker need... that called uh, Rosa Parks a bitch. He was like, why did that bitch <laughs> fuck that shit? You a, you a punk-ass <laughs> faggot. You you that type of motherfucker. You called the Capitol Martin Luther King. You can't oh. stand Black History Month. You you just a you just a cool. He's the one that shot oh, Malcolm me. X. This nigga would have shot Malcolm X, man. Yeah, hey, real, real talk. You a dumb yeah, motherfucker. Why did she obey the rules, mm-hmm. motherfucker? It used to be legal for slaves. So was they wrong for running away? But this bitch ass cool. Yeah, they was wrong. You got damn right they was wrong. Those slaves nah. could have shut them down there. They had fried the chicken. They had all the fried chicken they could eat. The chicken. They had ham hogs and collard greens. Why would you? Why would you leave? You want me to talk like a white boy like you or something? You, you, you are definitely a cone. I, I, yeah, I, I totally agree. They should have whipped my ass, and I deserved it. Okay, Mike, clearly you just want to have a problem because people don't agree with you. Because no one no, person no, has gotten on this they, they line a lot of people that, that said the cop was right but, for what he did. Say what? So I don't know why you keep making that point. Nobody got on the line and said the cop was right for what he did. Uh, those who have that butt are on the side of white supremacy thus uh, are just uh, bootlickers and no, self-loathing. People who ha- no, people who don't agree with you or on the side of white supremacy. And that's how y'all are playing it. Because no matter what somebody says, if they don't say something the way you want to hear it and how you agree with it, they're a coon. Because y'all Listen. seem to keep going back to the same point. People have been done with for about Actually, Chrissy, it now. seems like you've been doing that the, the entire night. But I'm going to go to the next caller, 703. Okay, so y'all have a good night, Hello? then. All right, good night, Chrissy. Bye-bye. 703? These cones is heavy. They heavy in the streets, man, and they cone in hard body, man. Chrissy getting upset with me because I don't agree with her with her statements, and I, I I can't be that fake when I feel passionate about this situation, and and I believe that um with the way he treated that girl was wrong, but she wants to make excuses, and and right. she, I mean she she's saying I'm not making an excuse for the cop, but you are you 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 are and you are defiant to what we're saying about what the situation is. So you you are yeah. kind of in his corner. You kind of representing him at the same time and trying to say, well, I'm not blaming the girl, but you are at the same time. You know what I'm saying? So that is a form of cooning. And listen, I'm not gonna agree with anybody 100% of the time. If you don't, if you're not cool with that, cool. 